and TV. Local 24 in high definition. It's time for Local Truck Live, powered by Sonic. And welcome to the birthday party, another year of local prep live powered by Sonic, the best high school football show in the Mid-South Bar now. And I'm Gil Tyree, sports director Doc Holliday, standing by. He's going to join us a little bit later on. Brian Finley out at our big game of the night. We have a full show for you. And let's get this thing started from Germantown to East Memphis to the Mississippi. We got you covered. And let's go. We start with the Arlington taking on Kirby, the Cougars, and Tigers tonight. The Kirby running back is going to fumble the handoff, and the ball is recovered by Arlington defensive end Thomas Cornelius. Now on the next drive, that's quarterback Tate Cowick handing the ball off to running back Keelan Weber, who goes and takes it 30 yards to the house. Arlington 49 and Kirby 34. And in the second quarter, ECS. And Briarcrest tonight. Keegan Westbrook's going to take the snap and toss it to the running back, Drew Kogard. Now, Kogard is going to drop it in a loose football. It's recovered by, for a safety, Conyers Shamblin. Later in the second quarter, running back Rashad Mohammed's going to break it 32 yards. He's coming at you. He's tackled by Caleb Jones. Briarcrest defeats ECS 23-20. to Now let's punt to our sports director, Doc Holliday, who was at the LPL Central versus MUS. Doc, it's all yours. Thanks, Gil Tyree. MUS and Central both have high hopes heading into this football season. Tonight, those hopes meeting up at the Owl's Nest. End of the first half, MUS threatening, but check out Stephen Regis as he finally, he is going to get it, but he is going to be snatched and picked off by Anthony Taylor. MUS up 7-0 at the break. In the third quarter, Regis tries again. In the air again. This time he hooks up with Jalen Love and Love. Snatches it, takes it 41 yards for the touchdown, and MUS dominates the Warriors tonight, 38 0. At Lausanne, the Lynx hosting the Red Devils of Germantown, and you thought this was going to be a good game. It was a good game for Lausanne. Opening kickoff, those Red Devils start off on fire. Rodney Wood, he is going to feel this kickoff return, and he is going to find the lane after slipping, and he is going to what you call get gone. Nearly a 100-yard kickoff return on the opening kickoff return, but you know what? That would be Germantown's only score of the night because Lausanne broke the court. The running back, Chris Witherspoon, he powers it in from five yards out, and Lausanne absolutely dominates Germantown tonight by a score of 42 to 7. I'm done, but Local Prep Live is not done. Still plenty of more show, plenty of more games. Gil Tyree, give them more. Uh, Doc, we're going to give them more right now, and we continue. White Station and Christian Brothers tonight. Deontay Woods, one of the best names in high school football, is going to break tackles, and he's going to bust it for 20 before getting pushed out of bounds on his way on fourth and one. White Station's going to fake it. The punt to Dylan Mitchell. Love this two-way athlete. Gets the first down conversion right there. White Station lost to Christian Brothers by the count of 28 to 20. How about Overton's Gerard? Oliver dropping back against Kip tonight to Dwayne Betts, who goes in for six points. Eric Thomas is going to take the handoff from Kip, and he gets by Jalen Stort, and he coughs up the football. The freshman, Daryl Franklin, on the recovery. Kip wins it 40 to 22. And dual threat quarterback at Millington, Eldon Timms, is going to run over defender for the score. Strikes again this time through the air. 47 yards to Kip Fleming. Millington takes it 42 to 12. We're not done. Time for a quick break, so don't go anywhere. Still much of the LPL left. Collierville, the cheerleaders take us to break. 